All right, <clears throat> so this is a video that I've been meaning to do for a while, and I just got around to it today. But there are people who are firmly convinced that I make the majority of my money from YouTube. So let's go ahead and kind of show you, because this is one of these comments. Let's see. Let's go. So you hadn't had a job in 25 years. Okay, if that's true, show us your YouTube application. Show us your check stubs from YouTube. Show us your W-2s from YouTube. Then tell then us what you call that. You weird. YouTube ain't sending no W-2s, 1040s and 1099. <laughs> but let's kind of go into it. Let's just see. So we get into the revenue, right? And we're going to go to lifetime because they give you the ability to get into the lifetime revenue. So this is going back to 2009. And as you can see, the majority of my time on YouTube up until around 2016, because I know for a fact I wasn't monetized in 2009. I wasn't monetized in 2010. I wasn't monetized in 2011. Oh, wait, wait, wait. How did I make money if my YouTube channel wasn't monetized for all these years? Oh, that's right. I was selling something. So let's go ahead and, you know, so from 2016 up to 2024, we have $190,000. Now, let's see. We can go with 2023. I made 16000 we can go to 2024. I made 2000 this year. And yeah. Now, this is something else too. I thoroughly enjoy YouTube. Now, I had a multitude of channels. So let's just kind of go ahead and go in here. And let's go to the other channel. Now, some of these channels are gone. So I'm going to have to kind of switch up and think about that so let's see which one should we get um yeah this one so we can go in here and then we can look and see what i made all right so go to channel analytics now Interestingly enough, I think I did better percentage wise on this channel. So let's go to lifetime. And so that's 190 and that's 80,000. And this was 2020. This channel proportionally made me $80,000 since 2020. And, you know, not really been doing a lot. So this channel made more money. This made a, a lot more money because this channel started off as Savage Finance. So we've got 190 plus 180, that's two, 270 over years, $270, okay? And then I've got some channels. Let's see, i got another channel. I don't think it's made any money because uh, I'll explain to you what happened. Um, let's kind of get into that. Switch accounts. Let's go to, because this used to be named something else, but I, I really don't think I made a lot of money from this channel. I really don't. Uh, let's see. I think. We may be up to like, I mean, seriously. Uh, revenue, lifetime, it's going to be <laughs> 50 bucks, 50 bucks on this channel. Because I really haven't been posting and I haven't really put up anything. So at the moment, I haven't even gotten paid from this channel because I'm not even posting any content. But there, there are many, many people who assume that, you know, I make all my money from YouTube because I have so many YouTube channels. And I will kind of go through the channels. This is for advertising. There's nothing on that channel. 
This is uh, the new Hustlers Kung Fu, which isn't monetized. This channel isn't monetized at all. It's not monetized. So let's go ahead and go to the analytics. And see, there is no revenue certain because the channel isn't monetized. So let's go to this one and yeah, that's pretty much it. Now I will tell you what I was doing with this channel and I, I kind of explain the whole process and this channel isn't monetized as well. It's not monetized at all. Uh, let's see, go to channel analytics, audience, I see no monetization. Now, what I was trying to do was a blind channel, my own version of a faceless channel, right? And what happened was that I got a lot of, let's see. Okay, so I was doing like a faceless channel and the thing that was happened with this was I had so many black folks asking me why the channel was faceless versus just watching the videos. They wanted to know what I was up to and what I was doing. I mean, literally, because I had an Instagram account and they would go to the Instagram account and see what I'm doing. It, it was crazy. But uh, I would say pretty much counting the disruptive mail channels and stuff. I would say over the last 15 years, YouTube has paid me about 300 K from my YouTube channels with the majority of that coming from, uh, let's see this channel, the majority of that coming from this channel, uh, not that channel. That's the wrong channel switch this channel here. The majority of this coming from this channel. Revenue and lifetime. So well, as you can see, once again, I wasn't monetized in 2009. I wasn't monetized in two. I wasn't monetized in 2012. Now this is somewhat debatable because around this time YouTube started to monetize some of my videos. It was completely, completely, completely different than what it is now. But you know, uh, this is kind of flawed because I did start, but I, I really wasn't making that much money, like two, maybe 300 bucks a month. And then this is when things started to get better. Um, Cause let's see, we can go from, and we can customize this. We can do custom and then we can go, yeah, we can do this 16 and then we're going to go to 17 and see what we get 7,000. So that's kind of like when the money actually started. So, you know, this, this is uh, where the money came from. Hustle camp. Getting rich in business. Getting rich in business was my most successful site. And I don't think this rub to mail. What? Huh? I don't even remember that. So Because I don't have a disruptive mail channel. Oh.
Okay. That's still on the main channel right there. Uh, let's see. Nope, you can't really find anything about disruptive mail. And like I said, I would assume because there was like one, two, three versions of disruptive mail. And then I took them down. But once again, uh, this, this has been the main channel, this one right here. So with this, you know, this right here, this is where the majority of the money came from, getting rich in business. And then Hustle Camp was the starter. And then I did about 50000 on disruptive mail. So, yeah. So, you know, all these people like, yeah, he makes all his money from YouTube. He makes all his money from YouTube. He makes all his money from YouTube. Now, I will say, and this is something that's going to be up in the coming up training, how to use a YouTube channel to make money that is not from YouTube. Uh, when I started going to Vid Summit, let me see. I wonder if there's going to be Vid Summit. Ah. All right. I started going to Vid Summit. Uh, let's see how far did this go back. Because I actually started going to Vid Summit. Oh, man. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, wow, I started going to Vid Summit. I think this was the very first Vid Summit right here, nine years ago. And then we got into some other stuff. Uh, they're not really posting on this, but I started going to Vid Summit. And this is when I started to actually, I remember this was Vid Summit, I think, yeah, October 12th. So I started going to Vid Summit and meeting YouTubers and stuff. And this is when I began to realize that a lot of YouTubers were, you know, I was making more money than the YouTubers that I was meeting. And it was crazy. It, it was crazy. Um. But this was the first of YouTube and, well, my first interaction. Vid Summit is the first YouTube-oriented event that I went to. And um, I literally started meeting people, having conversations with people, talking to people. Vid Summit was a great place to go meet people youtubers connect talk to them it was like it, you know the first few and then i stopped going to vid summit i believe i went 2012 13 14 15 16 17 so i went to six vid summits and then i just kind of started going because it you know it started becoming very different really different and when I started going to Vid Summit, it was the core. I mean, these were like the real YouTube YouTubers, right? So, you know, it, it was, um, I know Owen. I know Dane. I know Kevin. Owen, I know Rob. Oh man, I have, I know Tolis. He doesn't even live here in the country. He lives in Sweden. I know Jake. I know Daryl. And you know th this whole thing. So here here's my challenge to you. So if you think that you can make so much money from YouTube. Start a YouTube channel. Go ahead, start a YouTube channel, start putting up videos. Now, this is something that's funny. Uh, 
I will tell you, if you're young, this is something that you can get into and make crazy money. Alan Boy Raw. All right. This guy used to live, this, he used to live in the building that I used to live in. And now I think he bought a house. Now, he's not the most popular. I'm actually going to show you the most popular one. Um, so he lives in the townhouse. I can kind of tell that right now. But, um, this this whole thing, like he's not the main one. He's not the main one. I'm going to show you the main one. And this is the main one. <clears throat> I'm going to show you something that's really interesting about this demographic. Um, he made a video just driving around, literally, um, let's see. <clears throat> he made this video. With... Oh, this is a new one. He gets crazy views. He gets crazy views. Um, I can actually show you. I mean, I'm... and notice he does no shorts. <clears throat> and this is just one of his channels. This is just one of his channels. So we can go to Social Blade. I would not be shocked if they're at five or six million views per month, which means he's making like 100K a month from YouTube. Boom, 4.26. I was close. <clears throat> so Quan is making. <clears throat> now, this is just one of his YouTube channels. This is just one of his YouTube channels. Quan has, I think, he has two YouTube channels I know of. I think one is called More Quan. Yep. And literally, he made this video. This is the whole video. This is the whole video, and it has like 642,000 views. He's literally just driving, just driving. That's the whole video. He's doing a point of view video in Atlanta. That's the, that's the whole video, 642,000 views. So let's go ahead and see more Quan, because I think he has even a third channel. I'm not sure. Um, but Cozy Fleet, I think he's here. And these guys, I never actually met them. I, I would run into that. So Quozy Khan is getting 6 million views. And once, oh, he does shorts on this one. So that, uh, he hasn't done too many. What's the last short he did? Four months ago. So, you know, when you go ahead and look at someone's views, if they're doing shorts, that will distort it. So Quozy Khan is getting six million views. And if we were to actually give him. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Um, I think this is going to be off. <clears throat> But let's say he makes a thousand dollars per every hundred thousand views, so every million is ten thousand dollars times six, sixty thousand. Once again, I think he's between sixty thousand and seventy thousand, and sixty to a hundred thousand dollars a month. From I think he has like three YouTube channels. I think I'm not sure. Now here's the deal. If you want to make a lot of money from YouTube, you got to get views. You got to get a lot of views. 
because you know, you know, he 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 has um, the Lamborghini Urus. He has a Hellcat. He has a Trackhawk, and there was some in there. He just bought a warehouse. Uh, so, you know, and there's a group of them. There's another one. There's Island Boy Raw. There's Quan. There's another guy and another guy, and all of them roll out together. And once again, the views on Trackhawks, Hellcats are stupid. And these are also the most stolen cars. So you're seeing a lot, but literally, if you want to make a lot of money from YouTube, I don't even know if he's going to actually um, get into. And also, these guys get a lot of free stuff, like people literally just send them free merchandise. Um, I don't know if he's going to get into showing his analytics i'm just kind of looking for that because uh that's where you get the real deal when you see their analytics and i don't think he's going to show his analytics and i'm going to tell you why he's a young man living in atlanta and if he showed how much money he was making he he got haters he's he's got some real ass haters so I don't think he will go show his analytics, show exactly how much money he's making. I don't think he would get into that. No. He didn't get into that. But, yeah, if you want to make views, money from YouTube, like Ram, Stefan, <coughs> you got to get views, man. And so apparently Graham has three channels, the Graham Stephan channel, how us and the Graham, the Graham Stephan show and the ice coffee. So those are the three channels that he has. And, um, you know, he, he took a video cause Graham is older. He's about to get married. You know, he decided to take a step back. I mean, the guy's already fundamentally rich. So, and, you know, people, uh, and this is some, I've stopped watching so many content careers used to follow because it's so obvious their content is solely based on their affiliate marketing and chasing the dollar rather than providing true value that they used to. I mean, th this is another thing. And like, like, like I was telling you, Quan has haters. Um, people get upset when you make money from them watching your videos. People get upset. People really, really get upset when you make a lot of money. And this is why that person left that comment. Oh, you know, show us your, you know, once again, that 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 was just complete and utter garbage. But literally, I really don't make that much money from YouTube. And at the moment, YouTube, let's see, I can kind of jump into this real quick. Because here's the thing. Anyone that tells you how much money they made on YouTube and they refuse to show you their analytics, more than likely they're lying. Or in the case of Quan, I don't think Quan's lying. I don't think he's lying at all. I think he just has to be careful because uh, he's a young person. And he, he gets some real, real hate. Let's see. That's kind of funny. All right. So let's kind of go back into this in 2024. I made 2500 in 2023. I did 7 16 almost 17,000. Almost 17,000. I mean, there are many of you with JOBs who make more than 16,000 
and there's a lot more of you who make more than 2,500. 2,500. So, yeah, there it is. You know, for all you folks who's like, he makes so much money for YouTube. He keeps creating all these YouTube channels. And, you know, once again, the training, I'll get into it and I'll break down talking about the things you have to do to really make some real money. To make some real money. 